Signs and Symptoms of Vitamin A Deficiency Vitamin A deficiency affects more than 200 million people worldwide. Vitamin A is a fat-soluble vitamin that plays an important role in many bodily functions. It's made up of a family of compounds which are divided into two groups, which are preformed vitamin A and provitamin A carotenoids. The body can convert carotenoids into preformed vitamin A, however, it does not do this very efficiently. When people consume only carotenoids, they may experience vitamin A deficiencies. Vitamin A deficiency is rare in the United States because most people get enough from their diet. However, certain groups of people, such as pregnant women and children, are more likely to have low levels of vitamin A in their bodies than others. Vitamin A is found in many foods, including dairy products, leafy green vegetables, carrots, and some fruit. Fatty fish, such as salmon and tuna, are also good sources of vitamin A. Supplements can also be taken to help you get the recommended daily amount of this vitamin, but it's better to get it from food sources whenever possible. Vitamin A is an essential nutrient that helps maintain good vision, skin, and a healthy immune system. It also plays a role in cell growth, reproduction, and blood health. In addition, this vitamin is involved in the maintenance of epithelial tissues, including skin mucous membranes and the linings of the respiratory tract and gastrointestinal tract. Vitamin A also helps to form bones and teeth, and it supports immune function. The National Institutes of Health recommends that women and men should consume 3 milligrams of preformed vitamin A. A pregnant woman should consume about 5 micrograms per day, while children ages 1 to 3 years should consume about 2 milligrams of vitamin A per day from all sources combined. Vitamin A deficiency is common in developing countries. It occurs due to a lack of fresh fruits and vegetables or foods rich in vitamin A. The deficiency can also be caused by a poor diet even in developed countries such as the United States. Before we proceed, please note that everything mentioned in this video is unbiased, fact-checked, and reviewed by qualified health professionals. With that said, let's jump in and talk about the six signs and symptoms of vitamin A deficiency. Number one, dry hair and brittle nails. Vitamin A is one of the most important vitamins for the body. A deficiency in this vitamin can cause dry hair, dandruff, and weak nails. It plays a vital role in the growth and development of your eyes, skin, and hair. It also protects you against infections and helps to keep your immune system healthy. Vitamin A helps in the production of sebum, which lubricates the scalp and makes your hair soft and shiny. When there is a shortage of this vitamin, you will have dry hair with dandruff because sebum production decreases, which makes your scalp itchy. A daily intake of vitamin A helps in the growth of strong nails. If there is no proper intake or if you are deficient in this vitamin, then your nails will become brittle and weak. This will eventually lead to breakage or splitting of the nail plates, which causes inflammation at the base of your nail bed, known as perinicchia. This condition can be treated by applying warm compresses along with topical antibiotics or antifungal cream on the infected area two times a day till complete healing occurs. Number 2. Poor Vision and Eye Problems Vitamin A is important for normal vision because it supports the health of epithelial cells in many parts of your body. In particular, it helps maintain healthy mucous membranes and skin and keeps your eyes healthy by supporting epithelial cell function. A lack of this vitamin in the body causes keratomalacia. This is an eye condition caused by vitamin A deficiency that affects the cornea, which is the transparent front part of the eye. The cornea helps focus light onto the retina at the back of the eye. Keratillomasia causes changes in your corneas that make them dry out and become thin and fragile, increasing their risk of infection or ulcers developing on them. Inadequate intake of vitamin A can also lead to xerothalmia, Due to damage to the eye's corneas and conjunctivitis, xerothalmia can also be caused by conditions that impair liver function and interfere with the absorption of nutrients required for normal vision. The early symptoms of xerothalmia include eye pain, blurred vision, and redness of the conjunctiva, which is the thin layer covering the white part of your eye. If left untreated, xerothalmia can lead to corneal ulcers or even blindness. 
Vitamin A deficiency also causes eye problems such as night blindness because this vitamin is essential for maintaining the health of vital parts of the eye that help us see clearly in dim light conditions. Number three, keratinization of major systems in the body. The major systems of the body that are affected by vitamin A deficiency include the skin, mucous membranes, eyes, respiratory tract, and gastrointestinal tract. In the skin, keratinization and hyperkeratinization occur. Too much keratinization of your major systems in the body is one of the main causes of disease. Keratinization is a process that involves the formation of keratin, which is a tough protein that covers and protects all parts of the body. It's what makes your nails and hair hard, but too much of it can be bad for your health. When there's too much keratinization, it can cause problems with many body systems. For example, excessive keratinization in your digestive system can cause problems like constipation or irritable bowel syndrome. Excessive keratinization in the urinary tract can cause kidney stones or bladder infections. Excessive keratinization in your lungs can lead to asthma attacks or chronic coughs and excessive keratinization in your nervous system can cause pain or neurological diseases like multiple sclerosis. Keratinization can also result in dryness, scaling, and fragility of the skin. Mucous membranes become dry and cracked, making it difficult for them to protect the body from infections. The respiratory tract becomes vulnerable to infections because of its decreased ability to produce mucus. The gastrointestinal tract also becomes more susceptible to infections because of its inability to produce protective mucus lining needed in digestion and absorption of nutrients. Liking our video so far? Before we move on to the next symptom, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel so you never miss out on our new informative videos. Number 4. Impaired Immunity a lack of vitamin A can cause problems with the immune system by preventing it from fighting infections properly. This makes it easier for you to catch colds or other illnesses. In children, it may also affect their ability to fight off diarrhea, which causes further problems with malnutrition. Frequent skin infections and wounds might also take a long time to heal. This is because vitamin A helps the body to make white blood cells that fight infection. Without enough vitamin A, these white blood cells cannot do their job properly. If you're concerned about vitamin A deficiency or would like to ensure that your diet provides all the necessary nutrients, talk to your doctor about taking supplements or eating fortified foods such as cereals. Number 5. Developmental Delays in Children Vitamin A deficiency is a common problem in children and it can lead to serious health problems. According to the World Health Organization, vitamin A deficiency takes the life of more than half a million children under the age of five each year. It's particularly prevalent in developing countries where vitamin A rich foods are scarce. Vitamin A deficiency has a marked effect on child development, leading to night blindness, xerothalmia, and corneal damage. It also causes liver damage and anemia. Vitamin A deficiency during pregnancy leads to an increased risk of maternal mortality and newborn mortality due to prematurity or low birth weight. Low birth weight babies are more likely to develop infections such as pneumonia and diarrhea during infancy than normal weight babies. This puts them at risk of dying from these illnesses before they even reach their second birthday. Number six, infertility. If you're having trouble getting pregnant, it's important to know that a woman with vitamin A deficiency can have fertility issues. Vitamin A deficiency may cause infertility due to low levels of progesterone production by the ovaries. This can result in irregular menstrual cycles or the absence of menstruation. Because vitamin A helps regulate the secretion of hormones from the pituitary gland, which produces other reproductive hormones like estrogen and progesterone, low levels of vitamin A may lead to decreased fertility. In addition, low levels of vitamin A may cause changes in cervical mucus that make it more difficult for male reproductive cells to reach an egg during fertilization. If you suspect that you're suffering from vitamin A deficiency and want to try getting pregnant soon, talk with your doctor about taking supplements containing extra doses of this essential nutrient. How is vitamin A deficiency diagnosed? 
The body stores vitamin A in the liver, so the amount of the vitamin in your blood may not reflect your body's overall level of vitamin A. Also, it can be difficult for doctors to tell whether a low level of vitamin A is causing symptoms or if those symptoms are caused by something else. Vitamin A deficiency is usually diagnosed through a blood test. The test measures the level of a protein called retinal binding protein in the blood. This protein is made when your body needs more vitamin A and helps transport preformed vitamin A to its target tissues. The amount of retinal binding protein in your blood will be higher when you have less vitamin A in your diet. Therefore, if you have low levels of retinal binding protein, it means you don't have enough vitamin A in your body. Your doctor might also ask you about your diet, and you can be asked to fast before the test. The fasting time varies depending on the test used, but it's usually at least eight hours. Other tests that can help confirm the diagnosis include a dark field microscope examinations of cells under the microscope. This can show whether the cells have normal structures and functions as they should or if they're damaged by a lack of vitamin A. Vitamin A is one of the essential vitamins our bodies can't do without. It's needed for a healthy immune system and eye health, not to mention its anti-aging effects and its ability to keep skin clear and healthy. As long as you try to maintain a balanced and nutritious diet, you shouldn't have to worry about vitamin A deficiency. And if you like carrots or sweet potatoes, eat them in moderation. One serving a day of these veggies is enough to get all the vitamin A your body needs. Enjoyed this video? Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more informative videos like this one. Thanks for watching. Your wellness is our mission.